Good morning. Hello. How are you doing? Good afternoon. Y'all know how we do. I acknowledge all time zones. Um, I acknowledge all time zones because this is a global ministry. This is an international ministry. So I don't limit it to um, the eastern time zone, which is what I live in. Um, I just recently visited the Pacific time zone and it really, um, God really used that to make sure that I address all time zones. Um, he reassured me like, hey, you're in this Pacific time zone. And I truly, truly um, understood what it means to acknowledge all time zones. So anyway, I say all that because you know what? Oftentimes we don't listen to God. We overlook the small things that God is telling you. But anyway, y'all know how I do. I'm the Reverend Dr. E. Duena Perry. Coming on to give you hashtag there is a word. Um, let me give you a word. I, um, you know, sometimes people say you're always so happy, you're all so bubbly, and you're always, you know, you never seem like you're going through things. Um, I go through things. I just choose not to dwell on them. What I want you all to learn is that, you know what? Don't dwell on it. Dwell on it. The creator. Dwell on the sovereign one. And God shifted my life about 12 years ago with that about don't dwell on the problem, but dwell on the creator. Um, I'm going through something right now um, that's really heartbreaking. Um, just something I'm going through, but I choose not to dwell on it. Um, I'm on my way to work. Um, I overslept this morning. It is what it is. I overslept, but I did not dwell on that I overslept. I will not take um, my issue to work. I will get to work and be around people and I don't want to pour that out on them. So I want you to know this. This is your word. Don't dwell on the problem. Dwell on the creator. Dwell on the answer maker. Dwell on the way maker. Dwell on the one that you can call on. Um, yes, I call my sister-in-law and I talk to my sister-in-law about it, but you know what? I still got to talk to the master. So don't dwell on the problem. Don't dwell on the situation. Dwell on the creator. That's your word. Dwell on the creator and watch God move. He may not give you the answer you want, but he'll massage your heart. He may not give you the answer you want, but listen, his answer, his, let me tell you this. God's no is the best yes you can receive. I learned that a long time ago. God's no is the best yes you can ever receive. So I want you to know that, okay? Listen, I love you. Have a glorious day in the Lord and give grace to receive grace. Bye-bye.